student grants may not run to champagne, and indeed, whichever method Cardiff Institute had planned to celebrate promotion had to be put on ice, as Pyle overcame youthful exuberance with a mixture of experience and straightforward rugby. The former element was supplied by former Welsh fullback turned fourth division outside half, Howell Davis. The latter, as usual, came in the shape of bulldozing Fijian centre, Tivita Manasitava. The champagne may have been on ice, but the students still produced the kind of champagne rugby they've been playing all season. Two thumping tackles, two quick passes, and defence has suddenly turned into attack, giving Justin Thomas the chance to show just why he's caught the Welsh selector's eyes. Caution is thrown to the wind in King Coy at the best of times, but that can backfire. And it's not just old dogs that can teach the young pups a trick or two. Mark Dixon, himself a student, showing the kind of twinkle toes that wouldn't go amiss in the human movement classes as the students have to stick to their studies a while longer. Obviously, I think uh, we went there win today to clinch promotion, but uh, obviously, if it was a pile, I think they, uh, they picked the game up today and obviously, uh, for the to win. Mixed emotions for you, the disappointment of losing today, but then the joy of being selected in the World Cup squad. Yeah, obviously, we moment uh, when I heard uh, last week that uh, we picked in the 32, but obviously, we've got to wait now until uh, next Monday to uh, if we pick in 26 goals after, hopefully.